Oh, what's up guys welcome back to my channel my name is Lily for those who are new here and today I have a DIY Valentine's Day edition um, where everything is from Dollar Tree so for starters I am going to be showing you guys how to make this heart right here um, this all you're gonna need is a heart we sell these wooden hearts at Dollar Tree this is actually one of the orders that I have for, for my customers and um, so I'm going to be showing you guys how I make that um, on here. So you're going to need a heart um, and then you're going to need a picture. I print my pictures out on my printer and then I print them out on um, printable vinyl um, so it sticks. And then I also use the clear or last but not least you are going to be needing um, paper flowers. These are handmade cardstock flowers that I make I've been making flowers all day my fingers kind of hurt like my thumb and my index finger they hurt from making flowers all day long this is literally what they look like before you fold them yeah let's go ahead and get started on the heart so I'm gonna start by peeling the back off of my vinyl I'm gonna start by peeling the back off of my vinyl and so you're just gonna want to place the picture right in the middle wherever you think the middle um, is and then I usually use my scraper just so there's no bubbles or anything and I just like scrape it like this. This is what it's gonna look like. And basically after that, all you're just gonna do is um, just place the photos. For this, I know a lot of people who might not have the Cricut machine to cut these out. So there is an alternative. My customer does want the paper flowers, so I'm gonna be adding paper flowers. But there is an alternative that you can use for this. Alternative is that you could use the artificial flowers from Dollar Tree. And it, these would look super super cute as well you would probably just have to cut this down a little bit more like this and then you could just glue it there and then um, it would probably save you a little bit more money if you were trying to do this because the cardstock ones it takes up a lot of them and then you can even just like add leaves to this and it would just look super super cute so that would be your alternative I have a light pink and then I have like a brighter pink I have red and then I have like a brighter red kind of like a maroon and I have um, white so that's the colors that I'm going to be using for this heart important thing you are going to be needing a hot glue gun and a lot of glue and add a little bit of glue and then you're just going to set set it on the on the wood frame I like to start on the corners like the on the picture and then going out just because um, then I can like see what's missing and all of that this is what the first um, looks like it's just literally around the picture and then I'm just gonna be going out um, around it and this is the result of the heart um, she did want the mixture of um, all pinks and reds so that's what I have. Look how cute this is. And then you can hang this. You can hang it on your door. Um, if you have like a picture wall, it would look super, super, super cute. This is the first idea that you guys can do for Valentine's Day. Um, again, you can do it with paper flowers or you can also do it with tissue paper flowers or you can also do it with the artificial flowers. Um, inexpensive and super, super cute. Going on to idea number two. Uh, just a picture frame with flowers around these are so so cute on here i just added a picture of Ocel and i um but you can do like spotify frames so many artificial flowers again a whole bunch of hot glue you would need a, a frame i did four by sixes for this and you would just need um the dry floral foam um, this is what is at the bottom of the frame and what holds the flowers together you need a picture frame um, you will just take the back off you'll just grab the pressure and just apply pressure to it and then it'll go in by itself so now you have like a little standing thing um, the next thing that you will do is you will grab your flowers um, these I just took them off the little stem and they have this little um, thingy up here you'll just grab your glue you'll wrap it around and then you'll just want to insert it wherever you like it so you'll just insert it there the glue is just there as like it just works as a a bond it won't fall it won't do nothing 
Um, so that's my first flower. Okay, so this is what it will look like after. Um, I decided to keep the leaves just so I can add those on there. But your leaves, I think the leaves make it pop. If you guys can see over here, I think the leaves really make it pop. <laughs> One of my flowers. So, um, I think the leaves really, or all of them, um, it make them pop. Don't ignore that. Um, it's also a super cute idea. Now this, you can really get all from Dollar Tree. The only thing you would need from um, probably like CVS or probably even if you have an at-home printer is um, your picture to add. Or if you have like um, Polaroid pictures you want to add on there, you can also do that. Which would also look super, super, super cute. Okay, I just switched angles because my camera is dying and I really want to finish this video. Last thing um, that we have is going to be, we're going to be making a mug. We're going to be making this personalized um, mug. Mom actually gave me this idea so I have to give her credit for it. She wants me to do the, these for her friends but I was like, oh, maybe I should surprise her and make her one for her too. So, um, this is going to be kind of like the same method that we did for the heart. Picture for of my mom with her parents and all her brothers from when they were younger excuse my trade off fingers obviously take it off and then we're just gonna be um i already cleaned my mug we're just gonna be placing the picture on the mug make sure it's centered enough this is what the mug looks like now there's a picture i add sprinkle paper and we're just going to be um, filling it up with crinkled paper. I'm going to top it off with a pair of earrings. Um, I'll give my mom these cute brown ones. You can't really see them. But right here in the back. And then um, I'm going to be putting a little flower with the leaf. Just like that, the little we're just gonna put this on top of the or put the mug on top of the heart, and then we'll just. I'm gonna cut these because I feel like they're gonna look too long, so I'm gonna cut it about there, and then I'm just gonna insert it to this right here. It's a ribbon that I also got at Dollar Tree. This is what it turns out to be i think this is my favorite i love this um you can see the um chocolate heart box at the bottom the mug and then obviously there's goodies inside of the thing and then um the balloon i feel like makes it super super cute yeah, that concludes the end of this video i really hope you guys enjoyed all of the four ideas that i um uh, i came up for you guys um super inexpensive uh inexpensive and super super affordable and super easy i feel like now there's dollar trees everywhere you um go everywhere you turn there's a dollar tree that i had for you guys and i hope you guys really enjoyed them so with that being said don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time